the similarities between the European trade and enslaved Africans and today's narcotic trade are very striking. Describing the movement of narcotics as one of the largest commercial trades in the world, the Vice Chancellor of the University of the West Indies, Sir Hilary Beckles, continued his comparison. Many of the narcotic companies have more resources, more military capacity, more intelligence capacity than many countries in which they operate. So it was with the slave trade in West Africa. He added, the British Royal African Company had the full might of the British Army and Navy at its disposal. Sir Hilary noted, the reparations movement has also taken another major step toward reaching its goal. Ghana, speaking on behalf of the African Union, we are declaring today that Africa is joining forces with CARICOM on the reparations journey. That was, that was an enormous achievement because we knew that the global reparations movement will never gain its full potential until Africa came on board. Sir Hillary made his comments as he gave the plenary address at the Reparations and Royalty Africa and Europe, exploring myths and empowering truths, symposium in Jamaica on Thursday. Terry Ann Brown Campbell, TTT News.